Palm Beaches, and the Treasure Coast. This is WPBF TV 25. Live from News Center 25, the area's most honored news team. Jim Brosmer, Sheila O'Connor, Mike Lyons Weather, Mark Goldberg Sports. This is News Center 25 Nightcast. Good evening, everybody. Sheila O'Connor has the night off tonight. Topping our news, police have arrested a man they say raped an elementary school teacher earlier this month. That is News Center 25's Kerry Hill tells us this isn't the first time the suspect has been in trouble with the law. This man, 26-year-old Frank Glee, is in jail tonight. Police say he raped a West Palm Beach school teacher. He had been identified in a police lineup this afternoon. The lineup was viewed by the victim and witnesses. As a result of that lineup and information developed during the investigation, sufficient probable cause has been developed to charge Frank Langley in the attack at Palmview. The alleged rape happened here at Palmview Elementary School earlier this month. The teacher told police she was checking papers in an empty classroom when she was brutally attacked. Tonight, police told reporters Glee got out of jail for robbery on the first of this month. Just four days later, the alleged rape occurred, and a week after that, officers picked Glee up for a robbery in West Palm Beach that involved sexual overtones. The victim alleged that the uh, robber, which it was, did start out as an armed robbery, uh, lifted up her skirt and then placed his, uh, his face on the outside of her uh, sexual organs. As a result of an investigation, Glee has been identified and charged with six robbery offenses in downtown West Palm Beach. Officers say Glee often rode his bicycle up to his victims and asked them for the time. Once they replied with a time or attempted to reply with a time, he would either strong arm rob them or produce uh, what the witnesses and the victim stated was a handgun and believed was a handgun, and then he would proceed to rob them of... Uh, money. Glee now faces charges including strong arm robbery, sexual battery, and aggravated battery. Police warn they're still investigating. They say more charges may be filed at a later time. In West Palm Beach, Kerry Hill, New Center 25, Nightcast. Right now, Glee is being held at the Palm Beach County Jail on $10,000 bond. Police in Riviera Beach are looking for an 18-year-old suspect who they say shot and wounded three others in broad daylight. Officers say the shootings were the result of an argument over drugs and cash. One of the victims is listed in critical condition. Shootings have become part of the scene in sections of Riviera Beach, but they usually happen after dark, not at noontime. I'm just so uh, afraid of my kids getting off the school bus and somebody driving by and might, one of them might get a bullet. The suspect in this case is identified as 18-year-old Wayne Williams, who police say was the trigger man in today's shootings. The new mayor of West Palm Beach is calling for an independent probe of the officers involved in the death of Robert Jewett. Mayor Nancy Graham and the city's police chief, Billy Riggs, met for a time today behind closed doors discussing the public perception of the police department. In West Palm Beach, here's New Center 25's Julie Phillips. Mayor Nancy Graham says her meeting with Chief Billy Riggs dealt with plans for crime fighting and rebuilding public confidence in the police department. But much time was spent talking about the Robert Jewett case. They plan to hold a town meeting soon for citizens to talk about it. I think people just need to